guys. So today I want to do a little video. I was just going to do a teeny reel and I didn't want to do anything crazy. I wasn't even going to do it on my iPad Pro. I was just going to edit it really quickly in LumaFusion on my iPhone 13 Pro Max. So I figured why not do a little quick video? Super easy. It won't be long. I actually airdropped a little clip from my computer. So as you see, it's a really cool wave shot, some ocean footage. We're going to probably start it about right there. And what I'd probably do first, just so you see to make it easier, I could actually go into edit and I can rotate. If you hear a bird, it's because I have a new bird. And of course he's singing while I am doing this. So I can probably rotate it, I would say this way. That may look best. Let me see. And it's just going to be a little abstract kind of visual with some music, 15 second little reel. And let's go ahead and get going. So we're going to go ahead and go in the video. I got a folder with all my apps. I don't use a lot of them. Uh, Epidemic Sound is who I opt to go to for royalty free music. Totally worth it. If you guys ever want to subscribe or sponsor me, I should say Epidemic Sound, hit me up. But regardless, we're going to go into LumaFusion. If I was on my iPad Pro, I'd be using DaVinci Resolve, but LumaFusion's really great on there as well. So as you see, when I was out and about in Chicago testing out the new firmware for the Mavic 3 Pro, I put together a really quick little edit and color grade right on my iPhone just to see what I was capturing. But regardless, let's go back and I'm gonna hit this little thing right there. If you could see to the far left, it's a little plus sign. That's gonna give me a new project. Or that's gonna actually, I'm sorry, that's gonna give me this little plus sign right to the right of that is gonna give me a new project. So create new project. I don't even need to name it. Frame rate's gonna be based on the first clip, but I wanna actually do, uh, I think it's just portrait, 916 portrait. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit add. And this little bird is gonna, of course, sing while I am doing this, but we will be patient. Let's see video. It probably wants to throw it way at the end, and it does. We'll see how loud it is. <laughs> Of course, it's so funny how they sing right when you start doing a video. But right now, we have a 52 second clip as you see. So 52 seconds. I'm gonna use this little tab. What I can do really quickly is maybe move the bird outside for a second. Hold on. There we go. It's a nice day. The bird can chill out there. <laughs> so regardless, you can see I can trim right up here with this little yellow bar. I don't need to do that, but I can if I want to. And then I can hit this little area right here. It's a little down arrow and that will insert the clip into the timeline. So what I'm going to do is just insert it into the timeline. And now I have it in the timeline. And I'm going to scrub back, hit the play tab. And as you see, I'm going to wait for the movement. So it's showing 25 frames per second. There we go. About right there. And I'm going to cut it. And I'm going to delete this. There's a little trash can to the far right over here. And there we go. I don't know why it's showing. Oh, because I have info. So I'm going to hit play and I'll go full screen. And I'm just kind of seeing what's going on. It may be a little dark, but I'm trying to underexpose a little bit for the display of the phone. But it looks pretty decent right now. And maybe that's the part I would want like this little 15 second clip. I'll double tap the screen. 
And then let me go over here. I'm going to cut it again with the little scissors in the middle, select the part on the left I want to delete, and trash that. And now what I can do is color grade it a little bit, and I'm going to double click it, and this is going to give me little presets and stuff. I can do contrast or whatever, but I'm going to go back to original, and original, if I go ahead, you can see right here, I have some controls. So I can go to saturation maybe, bump up the saturation, whoop, not the vibrance. I can go ahead maybe, ooh, maybe lighten the shadows a teeny bit and maybe make it a little bit, no, I'm gonna undo it. There's an undo button up on the top, right in the middle, I'm gonna undo that. And I'm gonna hit play and double tap and just see what it looks like full screen. Oop. And the only way to really get good is to use the software a bunch. And right now you're kind of looking at it and it doesn't look super cool, but I will show you if we add a little music. So from here, what I'm gonna do is go to this little area, it's like a little star pattern kind of thing or whatever it is, like a flower, and I'm gonna to go to imported. So I have right here in a shared folder some, I mean, some music files and they're all from Epidemic Sound. No, music will dictate the video and the feel of the video and the vibe, obviously. So make sure you really take your time and don't rush it. That didn't work for me for Ocean. This could be kind of cool for just a trippy little, nice, relaxing. So maybe So let's just insert that by hitting this little down arrow right, it's one, two, three, right over here there's like a little down, it looks like almost like a little cake, but just a little down arrow, it's going to insert it, only the part that it trimmed is going to be in the actual timeline. So I'm going to hit play, Whoop. sometimes it's a little quirky, so I'm going to hit play, okay, come on. Let me see. What I'm gonna do really quickly is just force quit this and see what happens again. There we go. Now I'm gonna hit play. And I'm gonna just kinda let it do its thing for a second. So maybe, and right now you can see it's clipping a little bit, so I can grab this little circle in the audio and lower it so it's not so loud. And that's it. And see, I don't even want 30 seconds. Maybe I do want 30 seconds. Maybe I want the whole thing. I can go at the end of the clip, make sure it's selected, hit this little plus sign and then I can go to transition. Sometimes when you add the transition, you need to kind of make sure it's right in the exact spot so you get this, like the full dissolve. So maybe I'll go ahead and drag the transition, make it longer. And I did a little video on this too, and what we want to do is fade out the music. So I'm going to go here, Maybe here, clip it, delete the rest of the track. It'll probably be a longer reel, not 15 seconds. But right about here, I'm gonna double click the audio track, boom. And then right here, I'm gonna add a keyframe by hitting this plus sign. I'm gonna drag the timeline little thing, the slider. This is gonna bring the audio file to the end. I'm gonna hit another keyframe and then I'm gonna lower the gain, and that's gonna fade out the audio nicely. So this is essentially what we are gonna do. So right now. I 
and then we have the audio just kind of cruising along and fading out slowly. Boom. Not perfect, but for a quick little reel, that's not too bad. And I'm not going to even add a transition in the beginning because a lot of times on the reels, you want it to just go right into the video and not show the black. So right now we can go here, play it. Actually, what I'm going to do is export it. So I'm going to hit this little area. See down here, it's the second icon on the right. There's a trash can and there's an up arrow and I'm going to go hit that. I'm going to go to movie to share export. I'm going to go to photos. I'm going to keep it. I don't need ultra. I'm just going to do economy. That's more than enough for YouTube even. And then I'm going to hit this little upper arrow and that's going to save the video. Make sure you don't do anything. You can't cancel. You can't go out of this app. You got to be right here with the screen, seeing the progress bar. So don't do anything or else it will cancel out the export. And we shall see what happens. Boom, 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 boom. And quick, just do economy. That's really all you need. Now we can go back into my photos and see, go to album, go here, and then play it. Maybe it needs to be a little brighter. I'll do it just so you can see. And just a kind of cool, abstracty video. I didn't shoot vertically. I just rotated the video because it's an abstract kind of ocean clip, and that's it. And then what we can do is go into YouTube, for example. We can go to, oop, I don't have an internet connection because I threw it in the airplane mode because people were texting. Because um, I'm going to hit the plus sign. I got people texting from Hawaii. Come on, go away. I'm going to hit create short. I'm going to go add. It's 40 seconds. I'm going to hit done. You either get 15 second or 16 second reel. I'm going to hit the check mark and then see what I can do with the filter. If any of them add to it or detract. So far, nothing's looking good. The black and white's kind of cool in a weird way, but... That's pretty cool. Let me see it play again. But I hope this gives you an idea. It's really pretty simple. The only way to get really proficient and good at using an app, say, like LumaFusion, is to use it all the time. So, I can go here next, and then blah, 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 and upload it. And you could actually choose, for people who aren't familiar with Reels, you can choose the cover. Boom. Say something like that. And then I can just put um, relax to mother ocean, blah, 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 melt away your anxiety and depression, something like that. But just so you know, that's that real simple LumaFusion, create the clip, import it, use epidemic sound, Get familiar with the app so I don't, I mean, this isn't a LumaFusion tutorial, but I just want to show you how easy it is to color grade and do a really quick add music, transition, fade out the music, and blah, 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 and you have something nice to show that works out well. Double tap for full screen, double tap to get out of full screen, and I hope that helps, guys. Shaka, aloha, and that's it for now. Peace.